Welcome back, everyone, to Old World Blues, A to Z, in which we're playing as Dundurn. I'm your host, Mr. Jacob Dundurn Lover, but we gotta talk about our next focus, shall we? Through Blizzard's Cold and Sky Scarlet. Oh, I guess this one first, because technically I did this one already. Super mutant DNA is difficult to extract, to understand, but not impossible. With time, we've gathered enough to, uh, to move forward. And they say it is impossible, that the DNA replicator was a myth. I deny these notions. Why? Because I believe in the world to provide for us as we do our own. We'll push through the blizzard, and we'll be vindicated in our wishes. If not because the world is a generous goddess, then because I have built it. And then, uh, we can wait for that one. Uh, sure, why not? Hard work is a happy work. Despise man who's dishonest. Despise the man who pulls his punches. Every blow must represent yourself. The greatest might one can hold must be demonstrated at all times, or it is to a lie. Do not listen to the begging women in the streets who cry for us to feel sympathy for the lack of money. Perhaps it is they who should have considered their own solutions to their problems instead of relying on handouts and charity. Uh, civvies, arms workshops, would be nice. But uh, community service tactics. Fear the litter, nay destroy them. It is a callousness that led us to calamity. So, uh, I guess time to go to war with the blood of woods. Uh, let's not do that too much yet. We're only 10 combo, which is not great. We do have a lot of divisions, though, which is nice. So we do have eight divisions of these riders, enforcers. And I did make them 20 combo with, which is decent. Also, instead of releasing the Strasbourg uh, people, uh, we did get four divisions instead this time. And they have roller skates, skate infantry. It's not bad. They're a little faster than normal infantry, but I'm not really cons really interested in using them too much. Also, we have Lugna, one of the guys here, too. Um, he's technically a field marshal, so I don't want to improve too much on him with this stuff. So, uh, we'll see. Let's see what we can do here. If we can move fast enough, that'd be quite ideal. Of course, they have militia, so we should be okay overall trying to get rid of these guys. But you never know, of course. The speed is kind of nice, honestly. But our infantry is average at best. It's not great. Good. Hudson uh, Bay City Ruins. If you can move quickly there, that'd be great. You do move a little faster than normal. So, there goes the battle for Hooper Dam. And we're out of man part too, but what else is new? No. Uh, I don't think we can pierce these guys. Nope. But it doesn't matter as long as we move fast enough. Dawson Bay. Yes, please. A few more divisions. We're out of manpower. But that's always normal. I'm going to try to use a lot of enforcers in this campaign, like we said last time. So, hope you guys are having a pretty good day. We do have a cup of ginseng guava tea here to keep us nice and refreshed. And there go the Blood of Woods. Fantastic. Well, overall, it's not too bad. It's, it looks like there's one waterway here, too. Let's see what we can do about that. Um, heavyweight, light touch, beloved leader. Yeah, I'll go that one. Cool. Oh, we still have all the stuff down here too. Um, close out of that one. We'll have all the stuff to do here too. Followers are taking a year to get established. It takes forever, whatever. Let's see. Promote scavenger lifestyles. Staffing the Imperial Lab. Scav, wrong scrap. The fine hand of capitalism sways once more. Versus from interns and pen pals of bona fide science teams. Well, we went to the left side for everything else. We'll probably go to the left side here too. Promote scavenger lifestyles. Scavengers are sort of they sort of live off the land, cleaning up their space as they uh, do so. What if we made that into a business? No, oh, economic precision is great. The impossible, the gateway. Yeah, we're gonna need to do that because we get cores on all the gateway. Um, what we'll this one next? I've always despised them, the bootlickers. The bootlickers, the yes man, the sycophants suckling from the tea of successful men. Throwing themselves into a fire pit without meaning, or worse, uh, chipping away like piranhas at the feet of the great. I watched my father collapse under the weight of his own idiocy thanks to these men. For a man to be strong, to be truly intelligent, he must be held by, up, by those of equal strength, equal mind. Gloria Chase wanted to make the world one, but she failed to realize that a man was stronger apart. You may tell a man's candor by his handshake, be it firm, his aims are serious, and his passion undeniable, be they weak, they crave no good, and may be cast aside accordingly. A man who can stand on his own. A man who can pull himself by his own bootstraps. A man who can carry the weight of the world on his back. That's the kind of man you should become for those you love. Death to yes men. So we're going to start encouraging to get more... Uh, it hurts our armor here a little bit. We did get 20 armor, which is actually pretty good. We're going to lose, lose a lot of our armor here by including a lot of this stuff. Um, we're going to go ahead... Do they have a, you know, we're going to go ahead and do anti-tank here too. So, Because my god, do we need it. We need way more infantry armor and anti-tank. So. Yeah, we already have 12 factories on them. Which should come by pretty relatively easily. And we're with some protection. We're getting Wasteland uh, Militia's next, because as you can tell, we definitely need it. Uh, 102 is not terrible, actually. Let's do some military setting bonuses, perhaps. Well, once we get enough money, I guess. You know. 
And we can close out of the Spectral Cabal for now. The followers have stabbed himself, so be it. You know what, since we're waiting anyways, up and all this. Getting a free city basically for 20 political power. Back in tubes. Dynamite would be good too. 2277. Basic weaponry. Yes. Awesome. Good. I don't really want to use roller skates too much, so we're going to convert you over to this, and we're not going to make any more for now. Dave Infamy, lest we forget. Very nice. That gets us closer to what we really want. Hudson Bay Ruins, yes. So we have two trade nodes already, which is awesome. Great. Service, awesome, awesome, awesome. Promote scavenger lifestyles. Um, scavengers are to sort of live off the land, cleaning up the space as they do so. What do we've made that into a business? Get more passive casting over too. Uh, impossible, yeah. Innovation is key. Nothing for more manpower. I guess you get a little bit of there. It's not very much. Mobilization speed, sophisticated infantry tech. All right, yeah, we'll see. Consumer goods would be nice too, but like I said, definitely waste that militia first. In here, it doesn't look like it. That's fine. Whatever. <clears throat> Pariah's Law. If you aren't going to step away from breaking a room handle off in somebody's butt for back talking to you, well, then what the heck are you really standing for? Improvised obstructions. Very nice. Ancient tactics would be cool. We're going to waste that tactics. We're going to try. We're probably going to suffer a lot in this campaign. Oh boy. Address the commonalities. Well, do not bite the hand that feeds. Or do not bite the hands. Such a simple phrase. Do not bite the hand that feeds. No matter how many times it is repeated, television or otherwise, none of these dredges in the factory lines or in these factories listen. Then again, if they're on the factory floor and not in the executive meetings, who is the real brain here, after all? So we're going to mobilize a little bit more. We need more infantry armor. Uh, anti tank is looking not great. Okay, so yeah. You know what? I hate to do this. We've got to start working on anti tank. Can we hold here um, if we go to war with them? That's the real question. Do they start attacking us? No. Is we moving around a little bit? Yes. I want to see they'll start attacking us since we don't have any anti-tank. Three divisions. I take half to go up here. Nice. We need those military factories like now. Propaganda, yes. Good. Freshford. Why not? Should be able to win still. Uranium County, huh? Maybe they'll win, maybe they won't. I mean, more guns too, don't look at that. I'll put, yes, please. We really need four research slots. Uh, seeing is believing. It's a gentle hand of a true visionary that guides a civilization into the fires of eternity. The sort of man who can etch nay brand his name upon each of those workers' backs and hear nary a protest. Such a man and sage is me. possible to go here? Go here and go to the pass and cut them all off, potentially. Yeah, maybe. See if you can do that, maybe. Support equipment. We don't need more water. Support equipment should be fine, yeah. Uh, we're going to start going this way. So, it, so easy was to put the... Homeless, I mean, scavengers to work. Huh, exactly. I knew they'd bring back that infantry. There you go.
Well, if we can still go there, that'd still be pretty good. Horses, yeah. Economic advisors, they're all right. So MacArthur, um, the fine hand of capitalism sways once more. Some say this is ridiculous. Clearly, they've seen a hobo with a work tie. Not bad. I'm happy you guys here, maybe. Because I'd like to encircle and destroy these guys. Or we can circle them and have everyone else starve, but they won't really starve really too much. No. The Kingdom of Manitoba, Manitoba demands Wadania. In a recent bitter story, that's former glory. The Kingdom of Manitoba has pressed us to return their former holdings in western Manitoba, namely the state of Wadania, which includes a city bearing the same name as well as Greenwater and Rockford. While harboring little strategic importance, Wadania holds historic significance for the knightly order of St. George and by extension the Kingdom of Manitoba. It's clear that by refusing a demand would lead to war, conceding the territory may only be delaying the inevitable. However, it would afford us with more time to build up our military in preparation to strike a more opportune moment. We must wear options too carefully. So we just lose Wadena, huh? Is that part of the trade node? No. There you go. You know what? I'm okay with that. You know why? We don't have to go to war with them, hopefully. Soon. We don't, and then we can still do our war here. And keep pushing on. And it's not a trade node, so which is good. Because uh we need money. Come on. It's gonna take forever because they're gonna come back over here too. So why need more to tank? This map art looks okay though. So, let's see, 148. Oh, we need more guns. We're good on everything else, but now we need more guns. Well, that's not ideal. There we go. I guess we can buy more guns or something. At least that's slightly better. Come on. And we're almost there. Ah, we got there. Okay, cool. Oh, they're starting to get there too. Look at that. Nice. Local workspaces. Go into that one. It's fine. It's fine with us. Let them attack us. Get these guys situated first. Is this a core? No, it's not. Oh, interesting. Uh, it's not really enough to really do anything there. And our new help comes through. Economical growth, so too shall lead to societal change. And Kimball. Salanter. Hello. Can you do this? Just in case, we'll save and see what happens. We've got to start doing. Doesn't help that they do have a radar station there too. Listen, knowledge. Listen, intuition. How are we losing here? I understand this one at top, but this one down here, unacceptable. Come on. 
This is stupid too. How can we not win here at all? At this point, I mean, we should be able to pierce him a little bit. Because we have the poor three tier slot. Um, for as low, why not? He's got a 4 3 shot, that's good. Don't want that stuff, don't want that stuff. So he's believing, uh, how you swing it. Any moron can shoot a gun. It takes a dead and regular to shoot a gun with no help. No, you're going here. You're going to win this battle. If you can win here, you get that radar station, which will help us out in everything else we do. Good, thank God. I don't understand why you suck so... Well, I guess I do understand. You're actually really bad divisions. Mm. There's those guys down there's finest. How much of a drummer do we have? In five, not much. Now they have literally nowhere to go. Defender, just for all those times. Covering guards, experience gain, recovery rate. Um, recover faster, reconnaissance, decryption. Let's go with decryption. Knowing your enemies half the battle. What? What the heck? We already gave you what you wanted. So we can defeat these guys, and then these guys, maybe. So you try to please people, and just end up backfiring on you. What? What the hell is this about? Okay, so we'll have to go back and double check this, because this is dumb. What? This is so stupid. So, 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 so stupid. Um, so yeah, so you can just look back in a little bit um, after we do address the commonalities. The people in this world who seek novelties, pleasantries, and have the right to earn means to purchase them are the finest of society. Men and women who work for what they have. We provide for their families and seek out the inventions and innovations of our finest and endorse them with their wallet and not their mouths. These are the pillars of my society and the most respected citizen. And here we're at. We decided not to give Wadena to these guys. Actually, the game we capitulated really early, but really quickly, once we took out Manifest North, Freshford, and The Pass. That's all we needed to capitulate them, which was fantastic. Um, but I decided, you know what, we're keeping Wadena. Um, so, which led us to the impossible. It told me I was mad. Then, that it was impossible. Jesse can never be broken. The, those men now lay in the slumber grave, and their names, I've already forgotten them. So, too, shall history, once my name is printed larger than any other, and we get strained human experimentation. This efficiency growth and we lose some resources. But go are all the states by the gateway, which I'm okay with. So we're here we're at. We do have an encirclement uh, against these knights from the Duchy of Longenburg, which they totally deserve to die. Completely and utterly. Um, casualty so far. Uh, we're doing okay. We barely had enough divisions. We're actually not doing too bad. As we saw, we just made an encirclement and destroyed some divisions. Pretty nice. Uh, that's the name of the game. And circle and destroy, and circle and destroy, and circle and destroy. So, uh, 155 political powers, not too shabby. Uh, there you go. Mandatory service is all right. Uh, I do that for slightly more organization. Doesn't help out that much, but every little bit helps out. It's a flat too, you know. Um, I'll say volunteers. That's our auxiliary, slightly more compliance, which is always great. Can you get down here, maybe? And can you get right here? Wherever they've opened holes, we'll start moving in more. Actually, you know what? You go here too. You stay there. You do the impossible. Great. Ooh. Research speed. Resistance record goes down by 10%, which is actually pretty decent. Generic trials ability lead to great fruit. Our scientists must learn before they can be masters. Yeah, that makes sense. We're sent intuition. Uh, the gang. So we got a little more soft attack, heart attack, reconnaissance, organization, and division attrition for locals, which is doesn't help us out. But we do have the gang, so we get more forces, soft attack, heart attack, and walk if the tree gets better, recruitable population factor, and more uh, uh, reinforce rate, which is not bad. Ebenezer, uh, Scrooge. And our special forces are holding the north, which is fine with us. Hey, now they're like, oh my god, what's going on? And I'm like, die! Whoa, 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 you are not allowed to lose here. You're going to force the defense. I don't care if you, that division dies, but these guys have all have to die. 
We can't help him out here. In here, special local leader, life giver, all that good stuff. Um, I don't think the guys have recon yet, do they? No. Uh, heavy special forces. Well, go awareness anyways. Eventually, it's fine. Attacking with infantry is really bad. We need some dynamite on these guys badly. Crop rotations are good. Uh, more construction speed, yes. Help them out. Come on. Finish them off here. There you go. Do not let them escape. Do not let them recover any sort of organization. So, I'm still out of manpower, but what do you expect? Cord stuff, but it still wasn't enough. It's fine, even if we lose that. There you go. Nice. Hey, two more infantry divisions. Good. Good, done one more. Dynamite's okay, not fantastic. Um, this is just asking to get encircled. Hello? No, I want you here too. Once we get these guys capitulated, that'd be great. That's a lot of divisions. See what you can do. You might be able to capitulate it, maybe. There we go. That's what we're talking about. So the entire front side's like exposed, which is good. Um, oh, military factories don't mind if we do, because we definitely need more guns. Looking decent. Replicating. Um, well, encouraging militia groups. The militias in Dunder can be both an excellent reserve and pipeline for getting new members of the regulars. All we need to do is bolster them. Hey, look at that. Nice. Fantastic. Help them out. There's a lot of divisions here that need to die. That's by far the most important thing to do right now. Exterminate, exterminate, exterminate. Anything else over here? Nope. Good. Good. Else can wait. Nice. Oh, all these divisions encircled, going and dead. We lost 600. We killed off 5,000. Line infantry is nice. Um, one more soft attack. Sure, why not? You go all the way up to there. You can do very, very well. Uh, there's probably a river there. Don't even attack then. They're going to spread it this way, which kind of sucks, but. Hello. Oh, now the good Sampi's over here. Oh crap. Here you all to hold. And you tend to come down here. Actually, no, you're all one giant front line. Okay. That's fine. You know what? Come here. Save an organization. And then move somewhere. Spread out. Go crazy. Don't let him move. It's alright. Not bad. If it's there, that'd be great. I'm going to go ahead and raise this up to the funded militias, too. So we do not have time to waste. Okay. Song for the front of you, by this. Please go ahead. And you know what? I want the war support. We really could use war support. Radio's good. Description's good. Get here. Encouraging militia groups. Address the commonalities. Yes. Nice. That's what we like to see. Another division encircled. Hey, it's working out for us. Look at this. Not too bad. Oh, crap. Of course. Well, I've got to go back to the drawing board again. God dang it, I hate this so much. Why does the Great Centipede have to be such a-holes to us? 
Oh, they'll quickly take us out. Yeah, I gotta go back to the drawing board. God dang it. Um, uh, huh. Well, militia checkpoints. We'll allow the militiamen to set up their own checkpoints, allowing them to see and create communication networks among themselves. With a cooperation tool, they'll be in the loop, we'll be in the loop, and perfectly in tune. Surprise, the doctor ordered. Any self respecting society, innovation has and always will be key. We'll make it to so that Manitoba ever tries again, they'll be caught surprised by how much we've improved. Well, we've done it. They've take, we've taken them out, and uh, the Republic of Three Rivers is now justifying on us because they also went to war with, these, with, the, with the, the Kingdom of Manitoba. We're like, but we're like, yeah, no, we're taking everything here, pretty much. Um, so at this point, we're going to be slinking around here. The Great Stampede finally declared war on us once again, and they're going to kill them. Uh, this is annoying. This is very annoying. Put your forces. Uh, see what you can do. Horses are not easy to kill, but they are still fleshy. So. Death will come to them no matter what. As long as we can break over the river. Because they don't have a ton of divisions, honestly. They have up to 14. We have, up to, we have 35. And divisions are not great. But it is what it is. Innovate, innovate, innovate. We can get nowhere without dedication and intelligence. The old reliables. Um, the wonders of industry. It is far. It is from the genius of our industrymen that we defy the laws and the waste and impose upon us. Use some tools. Go that too next. And just start taking stuff. Pretty stable would be nice. Oh, uh, yeah. So, yeah, we're going to take some time to get rid of all these guys. Hey, look at that. Nice. Don't let them move. Uh, can we not pierce them? Hmm. Special spec ops. Oh, well, duh. You need some of this on there. No, you can get the demo teams first, it's fine. Whatever. Help them out. Goodbye. Not bad. Oh, wow. They had definitely been moving in and around, have they not been? Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I get. If I were playing as a great stampede. It wouldn't be too bad, because you can you have cavalry, and cavalry can move very, 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 very fast. Keep them in place. And they're armored too, so I mean that's pretty nice overall. We're gonna go and do the new season's care package because we we need that. Guns, we are really severely lacking a lot of guns. Um I think I, I just bought some more guns, so we gotta wait for a little bit here. Uh, what is this? Stoking a flame? Prize dogma. You know what, sure why not? guys should mostly be killing themselves, but whatever. If you came to see a fight, Pariah Hawkmoon's always been one heck of a pyrotechnic. Why not? Stability, yes, please. Oh, wow, look at that. Get that done, that done, it's nice. Feature spec ups quite a bit. It's a little out of time now. Construction, yeah. Sure, more cities. The gray stables, please. Yes, yes, yes. We're getting them. And they'll get ready for these guys, too. Republic of Three Rivers must die. Oh! Well, Alright then. Not bad. Tons of territory that we do have now. We're gonna tribute? Probably not. Game set match? They're gonna come for us sooner or later. We need to make sure, make them wish they wouldn't. They do, and if we can't do that, then we'll just need to wipe them off the face or off the map quick from Pariah. Okay. Yeah. So we got these ones. More breakthrough, which is good. Better recovery rate, defense, piercing, less max entrenchment though, but you get better line out attack. Oh, us not. Oh my God. Actually, that's really not good for us since they have a. Uh, Oh, I thought the Northern Congress was with them. Thank God they're not. Just Second Coalition. That's not too bad then. Oh, you guys are going to do this. Mm, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. It's pretty equal. Everything I'll split off just a few guys here. Give them two more divisions. There you go. And then from you guys, 
go right here. There we go. At least that kind of worked out for us. We just need a crap ton of guns, though. Production boost. Still no manpower. Oh, Brihawk Moon's a big day. Look at that. Pariah and her spark blades gathered outside the old fairy glen, where Lushy dared to dwell. Lighting her favorite bread and cigarettes, she stared in the mouth of the old manifest facility sinkhole. Um, uh, holding yet another stick of dynamite. If it ain't broke, she said, tossing it down to the pit of the top of a pile. Don't fix it, she turned. Let's wrap this up, folks. After time, they blew the fuse, burying Lushy in her own den. Uh, though the official story was dead, that was, she was dead. Pariah knew better than, no, than to expect anything without proof. To her, it was simple. If she survived... She ain't going to be a problem in her lifetime, and that was enough for her. The hawk always gets a snake in the end. The animal trials. Pursuing the animal trials has led to some disturbing reports if the indications have any bearing on us. Cool. I'll also probably do this one too. Planes. There's a lot of planes up here. It did be nice. Uh, the golden goose of a replication chamber. At long last, my holy device, my white whale, may never be my Jericho. With this, we'll push forward science a thousand, nay, a billion years. The perfection of man. Uh, we'll create a paradox of the wonders we will create. Very stable, very nice. Good. 150 caps, not enough. Electrical ball. Use some spec ops, uh, some uh, special forces equipment, but that's not enough. We gotta wait for military sending bonuses. Cool. How many more days we got? We can also go fast forward to the against them faster probably yeah just to get started because I don't want to wait forever for these guys that's kind of boring not gonna lie 70 days animal trials you know address the commonalities which we did before uh, the old reliables Thunder and battle wagons once rage against Manitoba like a mighty flash and fire well that air is long behind us many of them still linger without the threat of death we can fit them for a modern age and apply ourselves in ways we never got to test prior all battle wagon di dies hard. Many of our wagons are too old and decrypt to really be utilized again, but that doesn't mean all of them. We still have plenty to pull from. And we only left for everything, so we can endorse internal growth, but we're going to look outwards. Money is key to all services. To acquire it, however, we must trade. Rail line restoration. And the rail line in Denver was wrapped throughout the whole electorate. It's without a doubt one of the most generous contributions we've ever made to the whole concept. Remember the Union. Animal trials. Many animals were tested upon in the Dundurn Serum tests. At first, rad rats, then wolves, then even umbra boys and frost lurks, with only the last two surviving. The serum's effects were repeatable. The veins and skin of a creature would be blackened as if a sort of accelerated rot kicked in before the observer's very eyes, something between ghoulification and death. An almost bizarre side avenue, a circumvention of what is known. No doubt the DNA replicated something to do with it. Perhaps then it was an imperfection in the machine, or perhaps we were misusing it? We have no time to find out. Economic advisor, it doesn't matter. I guess we'll do captain of industry. Sure. Tada. Hey. Look at you. You know what? I'll shove you here instead. We need another general here. That's fine. Whatever. There you go. Have fun. Um, oh, actually. You go here. We're going to go with, not the logic code processors, because that is for the other route, probably Glory Chips, Veteran Warrior Leadership, Starting Attack, Skill New Army Leaders, Force Through Battle and Hardship, these strong words are able to, are fit to lead a man into battle. Dundurn's fine, it's just a white sheet, so. Job well, in Dundurn. Rumors circulate that General Pariah, Hawkman and Dundurn, has begun to amass a new generation of soldiers, built from the old and with many ways from the electorate's poor. No doubt, says a student socialite, these are the consequences of Timothy Little Hopes' teachings in full swing. Don't tell what becomes of, of General Hawkmoon and army. In the meantime, the can all they can do is watch. Let's see what you're made of. Yeah, we'll see. And anything here? Nice. There we go. Money, please. Not someday. Best 
special force minimum capacity, more organization for non-combat support units, more max speed. Remember the Union. The Union was 2243. Though rails have been built throughout the electorate, there were some mere restorations of a shadow of some pre-war network, they were nowhere near how they were today. After a day of dining with the Chase family in Pleasantdale, he waited at the station for four hours before his train came. They were the most grueling four hours of his life overnight. He made calls to every factory magnate within the electorate, promising to double their fortunes with his new proposition, and what did they do? They laughed in his face. So he said to himself, I'll do it myself. He issued a new notice to every working man and woman in Dundurn. Double your salary, double your pay, sign up with the union today. Within weeks, he had mobilized the people into a new railway union. Even today, the electoral uh, rail union operates, laying tracks everywhere they can so you can get where you need to be when you need to be there. Bless our workers. Fantastic. And there you go. Ooh, state-funded radio programs would be good too, but we definitely need that manpower first. Um, let's keep working this way. Recovery rate, hardness, that'd be good. Irrigation's good. Uh, recover oh, we're doing that? Not really. Bike our workshops. So we need tons of guns. Tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of guns. Can we get advanced tools yet? No, we're so close. Rapidian is 84. A united front and home. The militiamen stand as strong as the regulars. And if that isn't enough to stir up Patriot's smile, then I don't know what is. The Golden Goose, the replication chamber? Yes. Look at this one next. The first human trial is tested. I don't want to core anything yet because I just don't know like what we get out of this in a little bit, too. Um, demo equipment. Do we demo equipment on these guys? Yes, we do. That's good. Do we demo equipment on these guys? No, we don't. So it on, anyways. It makes it easier to convert from these guys to enforcers and eventually anyways. Strasbourg spark plates, that's what they were called. Spec ops? No, can't quite do that one yet. Do we need fire teams? I don't think we researched them yet, did we? No. It's whatever. Keep the Air Force down the hall. No. Ah, that sucks, whatever. Nice, we'll go to war soonish. Additional plating good. Gives you a lot of soft attack. Well, maybe not a lot, but it's 5%. Something. 1.3 ain't bad. How much money have we got still? 1, 10? Order of the Crescent Moon. Wow. MacArthur is gigantic. Ooh, Order of the Crescent Moon. That looks really cool. Grandmaster Matthew? Wow. Oh, generic focus tree. That kind of sucks. That seems really cool, and it is kind of cool, but I wish you had more stuff on them. Nice soccer tactics, not bad. And then we'll go with Cazador Venom, so infantry gets more speed and more speed and more soft attack. Not bad, not great, but not bad. Anything here? Chop jobs, division training time, cybernetic implants, less production costs, major superiority of metal, more HP. Ooh, we are ironclad mirror. More metal than flesh will take what we need to perfect our bodies or men over bullets. Equipment capture ratio, infantry combat experience gain. We don't need to give every man a gun, we just need to make sure that our enemies have enough for us to borrow for ourselves. Train militia, military first, lose political power, recovery caps goes down, plan out attack, mercenaries, popular officers. There you go. Separate implants. implants. So you give more cost, unfortunately, but more HP and whatnot. So. First human test, let's read about this. Supply route ambushes, only strong survive. Yeah, fight for freedom. Reconnaissance, organization also moving. HP. Yeah. Travis Billings was first to step up when Jacob Dunder and called for a volunteer. He was a factory worker, galvanized by the Little Hope Doctrine, and now devout follower of Dunder's promises of immortality. The science team was more than ready and even more qualified. After weeks of preparation, the trials began. They placed him into the DNA replicator and adjusted its values as best they could. A follow was 30 seconds of horror. The sounds of bones cracking and company and at times even overrode Billings' own screams. Uh, the light of chamber blinding any who dared to take a look. Even as the realization of what they had done had grown within their souls, they did not waver. They had come too far. You know, we might just wait for them to go to war with us anyways. Uh, when the traps emerged, his eyes glowed with the power of the replicator, and his skin was half rotten from the energy. He was a dead man, but he walked all the same. When they asked how he was, he spoke only in grunts, but understood the scientists' demands perfectly. There was some disturbing glee to him, a sort of childish giddiness that unnerved even Dunder. This is no perfect man. The Walking Dead, infantry attack and defense, pain train. Oh, 
pain train. Bloody mess. Cool, we'll use him next if we get there. Nice. Hey, we actually have a little bit of manpower, excuse me. Cool. And after this one, we're going to do the last one. Lazarus Rejects. The horrors of man can be unleashed as a scourge upon the land, so that every valley may become a shadow with death, and every last human may know the terror and fear that we have upon recognizing the weight of our failures. Oh god. Less speed, less division training time, 10% recruitable population, which is great. Division recovery rate goes down by 10%. You lose 20% stability, get 10% more attack. Just why World Ghost Time gets way better, though. Wow. There's quite a few pros and cons there, aren't there? This and oh, I guess we'll do this one for the greatest party ever held. I'll get more compliance. Oh, 50% reduction in corn cost for all the great stampedes core states. Holy crap, <clears throat> we did that! Oh, sweet baby Jesus, how the how the do we actually do that from Pariah? And then enjoy a war. With the fall of Leshu, we may now move forward into a new age with luck one free of further strife. Well, all right, whatever. Dendron's finest, you know what? She have you right here. When it expires when? For 16 days? No, no, no. Let's see. If we do that, can we actually hold out here against them? So we're going to war them. They call them their allies. Let's see what happens. Hello? Oh, they probably don't. They should probably have that, yeah. It's fine. It's fine. I'm not surprised they don't want to attack us yet. I don't think we can do well here yet, can we? No, 50 some. 60, that's not bad, actually. Oh, ah, now they're attacking us here. Oh no, it took them forever. They had to justify on a lot of stuff there. Propaganda would be nice, more stability would be nice, yes. Hopefully we can win there. That'd be nice. Even better ride control gear, yes please. Good. Use some planes too. Too many divisions to attack. Um, uh, that's fine. Here, go here. Not bad. On the attack, we're doing okay. Not great, but okay. Robotics, eh? What if you, these guys struck out first? See what you can do. Um, still giving us quite a run for money up here. Over here, we can definitely move in here. There we go. Oh, they're actually doing really well there. Go figure. Can you guys win here, maybe? How much manpower do these guys have? More than us. Who did that? Go here for now. Because we're just smashing through the old believers pretty easily. I like it. Make them green, yes, yes. Yeah, okay, it's not too bad overall.
Sure, why not? Combine arms. More hardness. And whatnot. It's not quite cutting them off here, but, you know, we'll do what we can. Getting rid of the old believers would be fantastic. Get out successor. Nice. Good stuff. Yeah, we're doing really well against them. It's not a second because they have Porto Prairie still, but whatever. Uh, yeah. Nice. You actually did really well there. Lords of War is okay. Uh, you know what? We'll do it anyways. Why not? It's May. Hmm. So laser weaponry. Up out here. Beat the crap out of them. Go in. Great race. Linked up with them. Great. Capitulate these guys. Awesome. Oh, I are gonna die. Keep these guys in place. Cut these guys off. Well, it's probably too late to cut them off, but whatever. Hey, Kazadorf in him. So even more soft attack and speed. Hey, we got him. That was actually way better than I thought it would be. And this last one gives you what? Breakthrough and max speed for enforcers. Infantry gets more breakthrough, soft attack, hard attack. And more daily command power gain and uh, special forces stuff. That's not terrible. Huh. And enjoy war. You did read that one too. Clearing the snow. Without the snow in a way, we'll be able to accomplish a significant amount of uh, renovation and navigate our lands far easier than before. With group taking in a raid. Okay, cool. Ball, Chichen Itza. There we go. Um, how hard would this be? They're up to 39 divisions. That's quite a few divisions, maybe not. Um, ball 37 is looking pretty thick. Overseer Thomas. Ooh, focus tree. Greatest party ever had. Middle mark, maybe? That's pretty cheap and easy to do. Why not? We like cheap and easy. Yeah, 20 divisions, you go here. Honestly, you might have enough if you could do it like this. There we at least enough special forces divisions. Just show them there too. Yeah. Thirty two is not bad. Thirty seven. I want to get to Grace Table quickly. Do that one too. Oh, of course, the North Battleford might not be too bad as well. Hey, we actually have enough manpower. Look at that. Go figure. Do three, one, two. Looking all right, yeah. Looks looks decent. Keep building yourselves up. Um, Yorkton, Wadena, Hudson Bay. Let's over here too. Why not? Notre Dame. Brandon. And cool. They do not start attacking us immediately. Interesting. Can we attack them? We have mixed results. Definitely mixed results. Can we go out here, maybe? Maybe not. Can you get in the water? Let's see. Yeah, it looks like we will break through eventually, actually. And we have already. Ooh. Okay. 
Drop that strength. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Nice. Helped him out for a little bit, but then it kind of screwed him over. Oh, we're over here, too. Look at that. Well, now it looks impossible for them to take us over. Or resist us, really. Hey, looks like we destroyed a couple divisions. Looks like we got a couple divisions that need to be destroyed here, too. Nice. Good stuff. Good stuff. Stim packs. Good stuff. Recover rate. Yes. Recover more and faster. You need another machine, huh? Three hundred versus two thousand, not bad. The boon's a good trade. Everyone wants a piece of the dungeon pie. Yeah, why wouldn't you? What's got here? Military venues, probably so long as it produces guns and armor, then we're secure. Versus best commerce, a civilian. Is man not tied onto a toaster and cushioned chair? Versus industry baby, a great initial push. Uh, I've been focused really to salvation versus new growth opportunities. The reservation of growth is far more important than anything else, but honestly, I think I might just end it there. We don't have very much else to do. Well, maybe we should do this. Honor uh, and then enjoy war. Maybe we'll do this one. Honoring our finest. Remember Lushy's victims? Yeah, we'll see what happens next. You know what? Cancel the oranges next. Good. Oh, we got him. Nice. Good. Good, good, good. Pretty good. In all, all honesty, this land auction is not bad. It's okay. I mean, I, we've, I've done, since the 5.0 update, I've explored several different versions of these land auctions. And it's not bad overall. It's really not bad. It's interesting to use. Um, would I recommend it? Yeah, if you're using Enforcers, it's not terrible, especially once you have this uh, Overall Blues tech expansion. It's actually halfway decent. Armor's not great right now, but you know, it is what it is. We did throw in some support, com support companies. Organization's okay. Soft stack's alright. Um, but it'll only get better from here, you know, as well. We're not even using planes, which is kind of rare for me, as well. Ah, this is fun. With the fall of Lush, your great threat to the peoples of Catch has been eradicated. Today, we honor the, to the brave heroes who marched to Lush's den and those who fell in a uh, wake with a memorial. Let it be reiterated, then, that Dundrun has, has and always will be a place to grow where business is and always shall be the mightiest law. Amen. Cool. Looks like, for the most part, we're doing well here, too. They've got the 45 divisions, most of them probably special forces, maybe some infantry, robots. Okay. Alright, alright. Calgary, nice. Ooh. Oh, it's not next to the thing. There you go. You go. Hey, more speed and more breakthrough, more soft attack. What's not to love? It's one of these rare campaigns where I actually don't have that re uh, research gliders yet, huh? That's unique, at least. Happy December, everybody. And we're actually using this guy, and we didn't. We actually went with a uh, uh, local leader instead of inspiration, which is rare for me too. 420 is not bad, especially considering that we're fighting mainly just robots. Not too shabby. Our recovery rate, slightly bit more, but still, every bit helps. Especially when we're fighting over the rivers, too. That extra breakthrough does come in handy. 15% is not a ton, but it, it, it's very noticeable right now. Infantry armor? Nice. And what? Bricks are nice. As you can throw them at people. How much more do we have? Here? Oh, we can choose superiority of metal. Get more HP, anyways. Oh, I'll grab that one. Why not? Because we can. 
We're done with you, Duquesne. Hmm. I guess I researched Recon, did I? Oops. Of course, we could have done this one too. <clears throat> and get motorized and actually get more armor on our soldiers as well. That was one thing I was planning on doing, get this one, and then get mobilized recon core. Because that actually gives you more armor, which is really, really nice too. So That was the idea, but never never happened. All the hang dogs, cha ching. Sure. Cool. But at this point, I think we'll pretty much win this war. It's nothing super major. Um, and then we're pretty much done with the focus is, so. Hey, if you enjoyed our campaign playing as Dungeon, please consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.